What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Juggle972 back here, and we have returned to the end of time. But, hang on. Let's give a uh, old Specchio a try again, real quick, though, because we need to have some practice. He wiped the floor with us literally, like, right as we got magic, so. And I think he's about to do the same thing right here, right now. Close to it. But you know what? Never give up, never surrender. I love this cheery little music too, just, why he just kicks your ass. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Make sure everybody's healthy. And... Okay, good, good, good. He's still... He's still very much alive. Okay, now... Uh, Nadia, damn it! God damn, he just he just does not wait, dude. He really doesn't. Alrighty, alright, here we go, here we go. Come on, Spec, yo, what do you got? What do you got? And T260, you're not really doing much favors here though, but you know what? We do need a little We do need a little bit of work. I'm not even gonna front. I can just judge that right now. And I'm gonna take the L right there too, so. No, but you know, what's really cool about Spec, yo, though, is like it really goes to show like if you can't beat him. It shows where you need to improve. I mean, let's see where I'm at. I got everybody at like level 10, level 11. So yeah, a couple of more levels and it'll probably help. So that usually means. So we need to go back to the uh, the present time. Plus, since everybody knows magic too, and now that everybody's got a, uh, got a spell underneath their belt. Excuse me. What's going on here? Now, now he, they're out the closet. Yep. Let's see. You folks come out of our wardrobe, didn't you? What are you doing here? I didn't think you were coming in from someone else's wardrobe at all hours of the night and day. Humans, I tell you. You know what? I agree. Wait a minute. Medina Village is a village of fiends, founded by our ancestors when they lost the war against humankind 400 years ago. Most of the townsfolk still have a grudge against humans, so be careful. There's an old, there's an old, an old old man who lives in the cage near the mountains in the west. He may be able to help you out. Thanks. But why are you being so nice? I thought humans and fiends weren't supposed to get along with humans. It's been 40 years since the man warred against fiend. There's no sense to use make. You know what? There's no use of living in the past. Of course, many other fiends seem to agree with that. You know what's really funny about that though? That really goes to show what some things have to do. You know, with our current society. And anybody knows what I'm talking about can just sit there and just put it in the comments. I don't care. And that creepy chanting that you hear? That creepy chanting that you hear is a bunch of fiends worshipping Magus. Oh, great fiend lord. 400 years of past, it's Magus commanded the fiends and wage war against the humans. But if Lavos can be reawakened, there will be no more humans. Give life to the Almighty Lavos. Uh, you know what? That's not technically true. But we'll, uh, much like a lot of people in the world, we'll let you keep believing that. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Go to the market. Got nothing to sell to humans. Huh. Got the right to everything. Eh, teach a boss. Alright, well, you know what? Maybe humble them a little bit. Yeah, if you can hit me. So yeah, um, fiends here do not like humans, and regardless of where you go, there's gonna be fights all over the place. And I think we just slaughtered somebody in this guy's shop. Dual tech. Ooh, Erbium. That beat you, boss. Yeah, monsters. All right, I'll sell. Yeah, but you know what? Look what he's selling. <laughs> Ain't that some shit? Just regular old shit though. Just being expensive. Just being just completely expensive. You know what? Price hiking, huh? Gee. You know, after what's going on, too, you know, it's starting to happen all over the place, too. And it happens here, too. Here, let me, uh... Let me get, uh, Luca in here. Let me get her in here real quick. So we can have her... Learn a double tech, dual tech real quick. Alright, what do we got? 
take these guys out real quick. I like how the shop owner doesn't die, but everybody else does. <sighs> take these out of the way real quick. Alrighty. Not much experience points though. Oh, new dual tech, antipode. 200 G for the night. You know when they actually charge you about 20. So don't expect to actually get, you know, anywhere. Ozzy the Eighth, leader of this great village, the great 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 grandfather fought against the humans inside at the side of the Fiend Lord himself. Oh, great fiend lord, why didn't you exterminate the human race four centuries ago when you had the chance? Hang on. Got a magic capsule. Fearsome beast lives in the cave of the mountain to the west. Only magic can harm it. I doubt a human would be able to make it through not being able to use magic at all. Well, I better get back to it before Oz the Eighth catches me. Oz the Eighth! And, another sp and a speed capsule. So, yeah, we've uh, got a lot to learn about here, too. Melchior's Cabin. Oh, you've come to see me. Well, by all means, have a look at my collection. Can I interest you in a weapon? I'll give you a special price. Crimson Blade. Ooh. Oh, oh wow. Hang on. How many mini do I have? Sell one of these. Uh, how many ethers do I got? One, two, three, four... Sell a few of these as well. Uh, hang on. Red potion. I'm gonna hold on to this right now, hold on. I'm gonna pick up a few things. Crimson Blade. Plasma Gun. Oh, he's already got that. And all we need is a Bandit's Bow. Sell one of these. You know what, I'll... S you know what, this media can stay. You know what? I'll be fine without it. Alright, let's get equipped real quick. Yeah, that's gonna come in handy too. Plasma gun's good. Hammer. Okay, we've already got all that. Oh, okay. If you wanted to return to truce, there's a, there's a shortcut through the cave in the mountains of the north. Okay, alright, well, Hecarin Cave, here we come. Dare to the enemies of fiend kind. Yeah, these enemies are not going to be anything. And plus, all these enemies inside this cave, though, only respond to magic attacks, too, so... Magic is the way to go. Take these henches out. Alrighty. Going down this cave. I like what they did um, with this uh, cave, too. It used to be blue on the SNES and the PS1 version. I think the DS version is pretty much the same thing as well. Keep going forward. Oh, look at this. Oh yeah, these guys are a cinch. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. Okay. Get these boys out of the way. Thankfully, these uh, monsters don't respawn. Okay. And some bats. And some bats. Okay, they're taken care of. Magic scarf. Ooh. Alrighty. You know what? She's gonna need it. And your ribbon. It will be good here. Make our way back up through here. What do we get? Oh, a mid ether. <sighs> and there's four of them. Yeah, that's a longer than expected. 
Kind of embarrassing. Nah. We'll be okay. It'll be okay. Okay, and there's a few more over here. <laughs> Marble balls coming your oh, there's four of them. I only remember there being three. Okay. Let's see, there's bats here. Alrighty. Hang on. They'll be fine. Work about these guys because I may have to go back and uh, go pick something up. And a level up. Mysterious Force seals it shut. Oh, I cannot wait to get it. That's later on in the game, too. Going through here, going through the river right here. Alrighty. And we have a boss fight coming up. Save it up. Alrighty. Okay, let's move on forward. Death to the heat to the enemies of feeding kind. Ah, then there's this pain in the ass. Alrighty. This guy just loves his water. He's a wet beast. The Hecron. Married Cyclone. <laughs> I've always loved that sound. Go ahead and try to attack. Eh, I don't think so. You're just trying to gall me into a counterattack. Counterattack disengaged. Brief counterattack break. Hey man, electricity damages water. Yeah, this guy should not be that difficult, you know, according to the, uh... You know, he, I'm only at, like, level 12, and he's still even that difficult. The other thing I don't like about this is this fight can actually draw out, you know, pretty long if you're not prepared. It really can. Nereid Cyclone. Oh, she's fine. But you know what? It doesn't hurt to heal, though. Turn water into evaporation. Alrighty. <laughs> I love that. Oh. Brief counterattack break. Okay. Any put bomb it is, along with a little bit more lightning. Gotta love this boss theme too. What do you got? Come on, what do you got, punk? Oh, I see what you're trying to do. Punk ass, fat ass, having ass motherfucker. I'm not falling for that. Nope. Not again. Jesus Christ, Luca, you are taking damage out the ass here, too. Magic, magic, ninjas, what? 250 experience points. If only Lord Magus had destroyed the human race 400 years ago when he first brought forth Lavos. The world would belong to us fiends now. <laughs> Well, he didn't create lavas. He brought forth. Maybe we can change history. Needs to get at the fairgrounds. Here we go. Hold your breath. Wow. Wow, boy. 
Hang on, since we're at uh, Lucas' house right here. Should be... Hopefully it's a Bond's home, too. Uh, no... Nothing here. But... And there's Lucas' mom. We're always off take with our latest inventions. Oh, yeah. Hey. I bought you this apple what we earned today, babe. The day he is. He's very thoughtful. He's a good husband. And hopefully he's a good dad, too, because unfortunately, uh, his wife can't walk. You'll learn that later on in the game. Oh, perfect timing. Tabon's vest. Another great... <clears throat> Another great invention just completed. The ultimate, defen the ultimate in defense for my beautiful daughter. Hey, Luca. We're working on some defensive gear for my favorite daughter. Yes, he has. There you go, sweetie. Now, you might want to put it on, though, because it'll, it'll make you better. Keep you strong like your old man. <laughs> you. Don't I? <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Well, looks like we must go to the Middle Ages this time. And when we come back, we'll be in the year 600 to see what the hell is going on in the Middle Ages. So, I will see you guys in the next episode. Much love, and uh, peace!